one of the things that the pandemic has exposed us to is that the world has become extremely interconnected. So the challenge is to move outside of our respective narcissistic nationalism to address problems. The economies have become interconnected. The internet has connected the whole world. All the stock markets are connected. Climate issues are not national. No individual nation can address them. Health issues can no longer be addressed by individual nations. So we are really moving in a direction where history uh, reveals to us uh, that uh, we, increasingly we will be living in a global village. Uh, we used to say that you know, no human is an island. Now we can say that no nation is an island. No religion is an island. No ethnic group is an island. The idea is that you can build walls around the territory uh, is really uh, 200 years out of date. Uh, the world is not structured that way and the challenges have more to do with the need for collaboration, increasing collaboration, to create that minimum consensus that empowers us to address problems. And here is where the issue of peace also comes into play because peace increases freedom. Peace increases the capacity to be democratic. Peace increases the capacity to address social justice and economic equity. And I would leave it at that.